Hello everyone, in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to promote your posts from WordPress to Twitter. Um, but you'll see that I'm here logged into WordPress and I've got my title, my text, and some pictures. Um, over here on the right you'll notice where it says publish, there is a little option that says publicize. And from there you can click uh, show. Um, I'm not connected, but um, I'm going to go ahead and click on Twitter first to show you how to promote to Twitter directly from WordPress. So click on Twitter, and from there, um, I'll have to authorize and log in. So I'm going to go ahead and use the um, School of Journalism and Mass Comm account here so that I can connect uh, the blog posts that I use from the WordPress account and connect it to the SJMC Twitter account. You may want to use your own personal Twitter account. Actually, I recommend that you do. So um, now it's going to ask if you have multiple authors, which I'm assuming you don't, um, you might want to give them access to this um, social media account as well. Um, I'm going to go ahead and not do that right now. But you can now see that my Twitter account is connected to this WordPress blog. So let me go back to that post that I had earlier. And now I can go ahead and edit my post. And before I publish it, um, I can go ahead and now you'll see that it says publicize to Twitter and it gives the profile that it's going to publicize to. I'm going to go ahead and plus, click edit and I'm going to go check this box to make sure that it publicizes to that media. Now you'll see that it's going to automatically put in the title of my blog post um, and then you'll see that I've added, and you can do this too, is customize your message because this is going to be sent right to Twitter. You don't really want to just shovel it right from WordPress to Twitter uh, because Twitter has its own unique language that um, it's going to want as well. So things like at replies, um, for example, this blog post was written by um, Ashlyn Nistroy. She is a grad student and now she teaches here at Texas State, but she wrote this, so I want to give her credit and I want to give her a shout out on Twitter about it. Um, I'm also going to be adding different hashtags like be a Bobcat, TXST, and any other community oriented hashtags that I might want to add. And you'll see that it's also got a countdown clicker of the number of um, characters that I can use in this post as well. So when I check this box and press update or when you, you, when you press publish, you'll see that um, when it publishes, it will not only publish the post to your blog, but it will also automatically post it to Twitter. And you can see that that's exactly what happened on July 22nd when I posted this. This was an automatic mm -hmm. send from WordPress to Twitter. And it's got the link, it's got my hashtags, and I recommend using these hashtags as early as possible within your title so that when it sends, um, it doesn't get cut off. You can see that some of this got cut off. So from there, um, that's really how you automatically send something to Twitter. Um, now you could also manually do it by, if you were going to the actual, this is my blog, um, once you've posted to your blog, you'll see that every single blog post title has, is basically a link. And when I click on that link, you'll see that up here in the top, it provides the actual URL, the direct URL to this particular post. So I could also take that and copy it and then log into Twitter separately and I could go ahead and write out my tweet from there and say check out the latest blog post and then paste it in there and then use my hashtags and whatever else you might want to use if you want to do it manually. So you can either do it automatically through WordPress or you can copy and paste that URL of the post and then put it within a tweet and then press tweet.